Hello friends, I'm Rahul Kumar and in this video I will, I will explain you how to create an elbow pipe with the internal thread. As you can see in this PDF, there is elbow pipe here and in this elbow pipe there are internal threads are created here. So in this video I will explain you how to create this internal thread in elbow pipe with the help of all these commands like pad, point, clx, slot, rib and other tools. So, so start this. And here I will select a plane here. As you can see in this uh, in the figure, in this figure, uh, before I create this elbow pipe, I have to create a small profile here. So I will uh, create a small profile. now it's time to create a profile with the help of that I will create the elbow pipe so to create the extra profile I will select uh, this axis and I will come to sketching part I will give this value as 60 mm this uh, radius also I will give as a 60 mm and you know that uh, this length and uh, this one it should be same so I will give uh, this one as 60 so friend I will now create a plane here as you can see in this figure to create the other part of this uh, elbow pipe I have to select one extra plane here so I will uh, select a extra plane and I will uh, select uh, this curve and I will set this point and now it's time to create the elbow pipe I will select the slot tool and I will select this profile and the center curve and I will click on ok so friend you can see it formed here the elbow pipe and now I will create the first part of this elbow pipe the first internal thread part so I will select this surface and I will create a point here from this distance it is going to be 40 so because in the last video I already explained that to create a internal thread I have to select the point in the internal circle so and the radius of this internal one is so from this axis to uh, this point it should be the 40 mm and now I will type C helix now it asking me the starting point I will set this point as a starting point in, and it asking me the axis I will give x axis here and I will reverse the direction here and I will increase the pitch and the height I will give 45 it's enough 45 I will click on ok as you can see the thread profile is created here and now it's time to create the cutting part of it so I will uh, select uh, this plane and now I will create a axis here now I will create a profile here I 
will give this one as a two value and this one here four and uh, from the point the upper part value should be 1.5 In the lower one also at the same distance. Now it, it's almost done here, and I will uh, click on slot part, slot tool, and it automatically select the profile here. Now it, it asking me the center curve. I will uh, select uh, this one. I will click on OK. So friend, you can see this uh, internal thread of the first part of the cell pipe is uh, uh, created here. Now it's time to create the second part, or I can say a second uh, internal thread part of this elbow pipe. So to create the second part, I will create one extra plane here. I will select a plane, and I will select uh, this plane here. And I will give the offset a distance. As you know that this one, this one was 60, 60, and 60. So from here to the middle point of this, its distance is 120 mm. So I will give 120 mm. Then OK. And now it's time to create a axis here. With the help of that, I can create this internal thread in this part. So to create a axis here. Uh, first, I will select this plane. And uh, I will give a point here. And its uh, distance from this axis, it should be 1 mm. Now I will and uh, other point I also have to give because with the help of that only I will create the internal thread profile. I will give this point here and from this axis to this point the distance it should be 120 mm and it should be connected with the internal circle here as now i will come out of this sketching part and now it's time to create one extra point here with the help of two point i will create the axis here so to create this i have to select uh, this plane here now i will select this point and uh, from this point yeah it's zero it's okay and from this point to this point i can give any value 40 50 as your wish and now it's time to create the create a line or I can say the axis here I will select a point point line type I will select the first point here and the second point here so friend here it is I, I created one axis here with the help of this axis only I can create the internal thread part or I can say internal thread profile here so to create the internal thread profile I will type cls command again And it asking me the starting point. I will give the starting point as uh, this one, and the axis this one as the axis. And I will reverse the direction here. I will increase the pitch and the height value 45. Yeah, it's almost done here. Now it's time to create the profile here so to create that i will select uh, this plane
now we uh, create a axis here So friends, it's almost clear here. And now I will uh, click on slot tool. It automatically selected the profile here, and I, I select this this uh, thread profile as a curve here, a center curve here. And I will click on OK. So friend, you can see here I created the internal thread on the elbow pipe in the post side here now it's time to give some colors here so I will give this rib 1 as uh, I will click on properties and I will uh, choose the color click on ok on the slot 1 I will give the color as a blue and on the slot 2 I will give the color as green So friend, here it is, elbow pipe with the internal thread on the both the parts. I hope you like this video, and I, I hope also that you learn uh, you learn how to use uh, the tools and uh, other things also. Thank you.